Thank you all very much. It's good job. It's, it's great to be on the campaign trail again, especially when I'm campaigning for somebody else. In fact, several somebody else's. You know, on the way in, though, just a little while ago, we met a, a westbound plane. And I think it was the Raiders on their way back to California. <laughs> I'm sure it was. It's the first time I've ever seen an airplane cry. <laughs> uh, well, now, in this election, I'd like to count on you to do for our candidates what the Broncos did for all of Colorado yesterday. <laughs> 1986 is a watershed year for Colorado Republicans. The people we elect this year will lead Colorado to its, its destiny in this decade and beyond. And you have some great candidates. Having had some experience in the business, I recognize good governor material when I see it. And Ted Strickland is good material. He'll do the job that needs to be done in Colorado. He won't be like that fellow that wanted a job at the zoo taking care of the animals. And he got the job, but then they told him the first thing he'd have to do was wear a gorilla suit and perform for the kids because the gorilla had died and he'd, he was a little upset, but they said, you'll only have to do that until the new gorilla gets here. So he was in the cage and finally with all the kids out there looking at him, he got carried away and he was swinging on a trapeze and he swung himself clear over into the lion's cage. And a lion came roaring at him and jumped on him and he went down screaming for help. And the lion said, shut up or you'll get us both fired. <laughs> well, we have great candidates for the United States Senate, the Lieutenant Governor, and each of the six congressional districts. Candidates who will help further our program for a strong and growing America. We have great candidates for the state legislature here and our constitutional offices and for each of the counties across the state. I understand from all that I've learned that the Republican Party in Colorado is the strongest and the most unified than it has ever been. This will be one of the most important elections in the decade for Colorado and for America. This election will determine if America stays on the road of progress, committed to the opportunity society at home and strength abroad. The present leader of the opposition would drag us back into the failed policies of the past. And our answer to that must be no way. Let's move ahead into the future with Ted Strickland as governor, Kathy Arnold as Lieutenant Governor, Ken Kramer in the Senate, and one of the best darn group of House candidates that I've ever seen. It's going to be a tough fight, but with your continued help, we'll win. Vote for Ken Kramer so that we can have a Republican Senate that I can work with for these next two and a half years. and vote for Ted Strickland and Kathy Arnold so you can have the same kind of leadership in Denver that we've been trying to provide in Washington. You know, one thing that makes our country unique in all the world is that we are a federation of sovereign states. Now, there are those in recent years who have been in charge in Washington, and some who are still there, who would like to change that. They would like to make the federal government all powerful and make the state simply administrative districts of that federal government. Well, our strength comes from this system that was designed to keep authority and autonomy 
over our domestic affairs as close to the people as possible. I know that Ken Kramer of the United States Senate and your A-team of Colorado congressional candidates will work to preserve this present system that we have and that's been so good to us all these years in Washington. And Ted Strickland and Kathy Arnold will wisely and conscientiously administer the power here in Colorado. I thank you. I thank you very much. I know that I'm due inside to speak to some other people that are waiting right now. I hate to leave, but then that's the way it always is. But God bless all of you. Thank you for coming out of here and send all these good people to Washington and to your state capitol. Thank you very much. Thank you. Right here. <laughs> <laughs> now, what do we do? Just uh, head for the people there.